when you're ready to get serious about laughing, join the world and laugh with Walter Zaney Blaney. A master showman, illusionist, and comedian, Walter Blaney has been entertaining audiences throughout the United States and around the world for many years. Through audience participation, Walter transforms any event into a time you and your group will never forget. Appearing on national television over the years, Walter Zaney Blaney has performed for Johnny Carson, Merv Griffin, Mike Douglas, and Dinah Shore. The comments are always the same. Yeah. That's Walter Zaney Blaney. Now, you saw that. I saw that. I now, you're sitting right here. Uh, you know how he did. Yeah, well, I'm not going to tell you. Yeah. But isn't that... Uh, isn't that a great illusion? That is sensational. We thought, you'd get, we thought you'd get a kick out of that. Just watch, and we'll show you the kind of clean, wholesome entertainment that bewilders audiences and leaves them holding their sides and wiping their eyes. Good, okay. I'm Walter, and I won't hurt a bit. What's your first name, dear? Brenda. Brenda. Pretty name, pretty lady, all right? You're a little loose, aren't you, Brenda? <laughs> You're very friendly. That's important. Thank you, Brenda. And you are? Claudia. Claudia. You know my friend Brenda over here? I guess you do. You're looser than she is, aren't you, Claudia? <laughs> I believe we've got a lot of loose women here tonight. <laughs> now, don't pay attention to what I say. Watch what I do. We're going to get another cage and another bird out. Let our girlfriends here hold on to him. This time, maybe you'll see where he goes, okay? And move over closer on the trap door. <laughs> <laughs> kind of sneaky, fellas, but it sure gets them over, doesn't it? Huh? Would you help me out? What was your first name? Brenda. Brenda. Just want to see if you remember. Good. Help me out. Hold your clean hand right out in front so they can all see, all right? Oh, your clean hand for just a second, all right? Okay. Ooh, I guess that was it. <laughs> no, they're clean. They're cl I'm teasing you. I got to say these silly things. I never know when this was going to work. I'm going to reach in the back pocket and get me out another bird in another cage. Hello, partner. I've got two lovely ladies for you here tonight. I'm going to set the little birdie on the flat part of Brenda's right hand like that, okay? Now, don't worry, because he's housebroken. <laughs> and would you put your right hand real flat on the front side like that? Would you do that, Claudia? And reach up, Brenda, with your other hand real flat on the top side, way up high. You reach way up high with your other hand. Put, your, put it on the back side and hold on tight, all right? I do say these silly things because I never know when the cage will go. Now, night before last, I was at the Hyatt Regency in Houston and a big, big banquet, and the lady on the left was tickling the bird, Brenda. Her finger was through the bar, and that's the, the, that's the dangerous part. And uh, so instead of the cage vanishing, the young lady holding on to it disappears. Look out! <laughs> well, they tried a big hand with two lovely ladies. Look at that, right? That's okay, Claudia, when you get through, it's my turn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 